What is good everybody, it's your boy Slim, aka Mr. Different, back with another video and today we'll continue on with this mixing and mastering this full song. You ever seen the first video? I'll make sure I put it up there in the cards, up in the screen, somewhere around there. We can check out the first video where I showed you how I mix using third party plugins. Today I'm going to show you how I master using third party plugins and for all those who keep asking me over and over and over, yes, I am going to do a stock plugin mixing and mastering video after this one, so don't worry, it's coming. Don't leave it in the comments. Well, you can leave the comments. I'm just gonna ignore it. But there is a video coming that will show you how to do the exact same things using stock plugins. So don't worry. I got you guys, like I always do. But anyway, with that being said, let's go ahead and jump inside FS Studio. Show you guys how I Mr. Mixter, how I master my songs in my own unique way to get the sound that I'm looking for. Maybe you can learn something from it as well. Here we go. So here we are inside of FL Studio. Once again, here's the song that we mixed from the previous track. If you don't, the previous video, if you don't remember the sound, like, I'll just play a little snippet of so you can kind of get to hear what it sounds like in its current form. Let's get it. You know that I'm with it. No, we acting a fool in the issue. I stay with my bro. I call him an artist. He's drawing down with a pistol. He'll draw a line with a pistol. Damn, nigga, the cross. You can bet your hands for show. We're shooting this shit like a club. That deck on my phone when I'm showing no pill. I'm right on their necks. They leave me no choice. I break out the sticks like we building a board. Get out of fire, smash the base with your voice. They think you're no plan, no build like a fort. So tough. Playing chicken and. So there, there we go right there so you can hear exactly what it sounds like and you know let's go ahead and match it so the first thing that i'm gonna do and i'll make sure i ain't got nothing on my master bus i just got you lean on there so i ain't gotta worry about nothing and i'm going to render this down as a as a full like two track stereo track i like to match my stuff in the two track you can master it inside the inside like the project or whatever but i just want to you know commit to it and you know do it that way that's just how i work so if you ever want to do that you go to export we're gonna do wave file course we're gonna find somewhere to save it. Wait, five for jump it done done. I'm gonna call it Master Ring. So I know. And then we're going to save it. And I'm gonna do a 24-bit wave file. Make sure everything's matched. We're not gonna split the channels, leave everything regular. You can change the resampling size, whatever. And I'm just gonna render. So we'll be right back when that's done. Okay, so we're back. That took longer than I thought. I had a Bunch of stuff going on, so it took a little bit longer than I thought to render. So let's go ahead and drag that inside of F Studio. Let's drag it into the, the actual project itself. So it's fine. So now we have a two track stereo file of everything. So if we play it back. Well, then do it in. Yo, yo. Kicking it down. We coming for most. Yo. 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 So yeah. All same thing, nothing different there. We're going to put it on an empty mixer channel right here. Six will be fine. Let's just go ahead and check out, see how loud everything is, see how the loudness is. Well, then do it in. Yo, yo. Kicking it down. We coming for more. Yo, yo. Small circles. We coming for more. Let's get it. You know that I'm with it. No, we acting a fool in the issue. I stay with my bro. I call him an artist. He's drawing down with a pistol. He'll draw a line with a pistol. So cool. I got about negative three, between negative five, negative three dB of headroom. So that's pretty good. That's going to give me enough to master with. You always want to try to aim between like six and negative three if possible. If you can't, then just work with what you got. But just know you can't make it too loud because it'll start distorting faster. So just remember that. So. What are we gonna do to match this? Now there are two plugins that I always use no matter what, and then there is a assortment of other plugins I use. So the main plugins I usually use, depending on what I'm going for, the sound I'm going for, is either gonna be the TG Master Channel from Waves or the Affected Mushroom Pusher by Waves. To me, those two plugins are the best plugins for just getting a polished mix mix sound, and then I will either use you know my favorite limiters such as L2. Uh, Pro L2, uh, what's the other one? The K Clip 3, or I might just use Ozone 8 in this case, which I'll probably do that. So that's how I go about it. Of course, most master engineers do a lot more stuff with there, but I like to keep it simple. And the less plugins I can use to get the result I'm looking for is always the best. So let's go ahead and put the affected mushroom pusher on there first, and we'll start with that. And then we'll put on like Ozone 8, and I'll show you how I work with Ozone 8. So I am pusher. 
basically this is a really dope plugin it's an all-in-one kind of mastering solution but i use it to get a final polish mix i don't really use it for mastering i usually get a mix well it's gonna be matching this case but anyway so like i said i'll leave a link in the description below where you can pick up this um plugin right here from ways also i'll put in a 10 percent discount to ways you know it just be supporting me it helped me out you get a 10 percent discount i gave a few little credits to buy a plugin it's all good support me support you heavier plugin if you like this plugin yourself you know there it is right there coupon code in the description below so what this allow you to do is to affect pretty much the highs mids the lows and the stereo feel and pretty much you know kind of create the perfect mix or polished mix before you go into mastering that's how i'm gonna use it so let's go ahead and do it and you know show you how it works so make sure it's on there yep on there and let's go bro. Then do it in. Yo, yo. so what i like to do i like to start with the highs first so we'll put right here where the B actually come in. That way, you know, we're starting a little sooner. So I'm gonna start with the highs. I'm gonna move to the magic and then I'm gonna move with the body and lows to get the sound I want to. But first you wanna get this input going in pretty good. You wanna, as they say, when it starts turning orange or yellow, that's when it's at a good spot, but just do it by ear, it's good for you. You don't wanna have it in the red because that just sound bad. So keep that in mind. Let's get it. You know that I'm with it. No, we adding a fool in the issue. I stay with my bro. I call him my artist. He's drawing down with a pistol. He'll draw a line with a pistol. Damn, nigga, the cross. You can bet your ass to show. We shoot with this shit like a club. That they come up for what I'm showing. No feel. I'm right on their neck. Now, I am going further than normally. You go all the way, get it where you can hear what the effect is doing, and then I always bring it back to kind of tame it. That's how I'm going to do this right now. So the highs, I push them all the way to a super bright, and I just bring it down to a still kind of bright, but not super bright. So that's how I like to do that. You know, just get a little brightness, a little sheen in there. Next, go to the magic. This is more focused on the mid section. So you got the focus, which is more of the vocal, where the vocals sit, and the dynamic punch is giving like a little bit of multi-band compression going on in the magic. You know, just determine how much you get. Let's get it. You know that I'm with it. No, we adding a fool in the issue. I stay with my bro. I call him my artist. He's drawing down with a pistol. He'll draw a line with a pistol. Damn, nigga, the cross. You can bet your ass to show. We shoot into shit like a club. Bet they come up for what I'm showing. No feel. I'm right on their necks. They leave me no choice. I break out the sticks like we building a fort. Get out of fire. Smash the base with your voice. They think you no plan. No built like a fort. So tough. Playing chicken and life. You get plucked for your fellas. So niggas speak fuck and they scared of the pressure. Get tell the soul what you do or whatever. They whisper like bitches. I know that they listen. So Nice, you know, just give a little bit of mid focus, you know, we can hear the vocals better, give a little bit up front, you know, since the mix is already really good, this is kind of pushing it a little bit further to kind of round it out. Now just get some lows, it's the body right here, so just get a little bit of the, the, the low mid is at. Let's get it. You know that I'm with it. No, we adding a fool in the issue. I stay with my bro. I call him my artist. He's drawing down with a pistol. He'll draw a line with a pistol. Damn, nigga, the cross. You can bet your ass to show. We shoot into shit like a club. Bet they come up for what I'm showing. No feel. I'm right on their necks. It's pretty good right there. Just give a little bit of lows to the low mids and like that. Now, this is where you get like the sub frequencies and you can actually choose the key. You know, and depending on the key, depending on the hertz you'll be boosting. I'm just going to leave it at D1 because, you know, I want to boost everything below there. And just kind of give us a little bit more subbing this because I know my artist, Jumpman Dun Dun. Link in the description below. Check out all his stuff. He likes the lows. He want to uh, he wants stuff to knock in the trunk and all that. You know what I'm saying? So, therefore, I want to make sure I at least deliver that without sacrificing the highs and mids as well. So, let's see if we can get a little bit of lows up in here. Let's get it. You know that I'm with it. No, we adding a fool in the issue. I stay with my bro. I call him my artist. He's drawing down with a pistol. He'll draw a line with a pistol. Damn, nigga, the cross. You can bet your ass to show. We shoot into shit like a club. Bet they come up for what I'm showing. No feel. I'm right on their necks. They leave me no choice. I break out the sticks like we building a fort. Get out of fire. Smash the base with your voice. They think you no plan. No built like a fort. So tough. Playing chicken and life. You get plucked for your fellas. Some niggas speak fuck and they scared of the pressure. Get tell the soul what you do or whatever. They whisper like bitches. I know that they listen. So and now I'm just going to mess with the stereo image to give a little bit of whiteness, not too much because too much will, of course, introduce phasing, but just enough to kind of just, you know, give a little bit of whiteness in there. Let's get it. You know that I'm with it. No, we adding a fool in the issue. I stay with my bro. I call him my artist. He's drawing down with a pistol. He'll draw a line with a pistol. Damn, nigga, the cross. You can bet your ass to show. We shoot with this. That's here to be before and after. Let's get it. You know that I'm with it. No, we adding a fool in the issue. I stay with my bro. I call him my artist. He's drawing down with a pistol. 
He'll draw a line with the pistol. Damn yeah. nigga, the cross. You can bet your ass for soap. We shoot with this shit, let your club. That deck on my phone, but I'm showing no fear. I'm right on their necks, they leave me no choice. I break out the sticks like we building a fort. Get out of fire, snatch the base with your boys. They think you no plan, no built like a fort. So tough. Playing chicken and life, you get plucked for your fellas. So niggas keep fucking, they scared of the. You see how it just. This one plugin just polishes up the entire mix. If you already got a really good mix, this plugin will give you a really good polish to it and just make it sound that much closer to the professional sound you're going for. And it's one plugin that does everything in one. Like I said, if I don't use this plugin, if I'm going for more of a hip hop, lo fi type of sound, I'll use the TG Master Channel because it has some good tape emulation stuff like that in it. But if I'm going for a modern trap, hip hop, RB pop sound, then I'm definitely grabbing the, the MI Pusher as well. So I'll do probably do a video on the TG Matchman channel later down the road, but you can just see how all-in-one plugin like this can really do you good. This is one of my secret weapons that I always use that I haven't really told nobody about, but there you go, now you know. So now the last plugin we're gonna use is of course Ozone Isotope 8, which is gonna be right here. And this is just gonna kind of give me a, you know, a master preset as we call it, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, we're using presets and we're taking them presets and we're making them our own. So let's go ahead and use the master assistant and I'm gonna use for streaming of course and then just gonna play it and let it do its thing. Let's get it, you know that I'm with it. No, we ain't fooling the issue. I stay with my bro, I call him my artist. He's drawing down with a pistol. He'll draw a line with a pistol. Damn nigga, the cross, you can bet your ass. So we shoot with this shit, let the club that deck on my phone, but I'm showing no fear. I'm right on their necks, they leave me no choice. I break out the sticks like we building a fort. Get out of fire, snatch the base with your voice. They think you no plan, no built like a fort. So tough, playing chicken and life, you get plucked for your fellas. So niggas keep fucking, they scared of the pressure. Get your All right, so let's see exactly what it did to our overall mix. Let's go ahead and bypass it. Bypass this. Let's get it, you know that I'm with it. No, we acting a fool in the issue. I stay with my bro, I call him my artist. He draw down with a pistol. He'll draw a line with a pistol. Damn nigga, the cross. You can bet your ass for I can tell right off the bat that it kind of lowered my lows a little bit and kind of made sure my mids and highs are a little bit higher. That way, you know, the vocals and everything speak out. So that's really good. One thing I like about Ozone 8 Advanced is it has this game match feature. So anytime that you bypass it, you won't dip in volume. It'll say the same volume and it'll just bypass all of the actual plugins so you can just hear exactly what it's doing so i'm gonna be using that that's a great little feature i think all the ozones had that even elements has that feature to it so let's see what the eq did hmm so i'm not really a big fan of what it's doing to my lows right here so i might turn it on obviously if it's really affecting it like i said never just go with what it's giving you tweak it to your heart's content so let's just buy un bypass see what it's actually doing to my lows Let's get it, you know that I'm with it. No, we acting a fool in the issue. I stay with my bro, I call him my artist. He draw down with a pistol. He'll draw a line with a pistol. Damn nigga, the cross. You can bet your ass for so Okay, so I'm gonna take that away because I don't like what it's doing to my lows. Uh, let's see what frequencies is messing with with these this two and three band. Let's get it, you know that I'm with it. No, we acting a fool in the issue. I stay with my bro, I call him my artist. Okay, so that's where the vocals are coming through or shining through. I like kind of like that. Um, I don't really need the high boost because, like I said, the affected mushroom is already doing that, so that's dope. It's not using that dynamics. Um, I don't really think I need any kind of bus compression in here because I was doing that within the affected mushroom, so I don't worry about that. Dynamic EQ wise, um, there's a couple little dips in here. Let's see what this doing to it. Let's get it. You know that I'm with it. No, we acting a fool in the issue. Okay, I like what it's doing with three and four because that's like a real ringing sound. So it's, you know, controlling that ringing sound, which is dope. Up in here, of course, that little high sibilance is kind of controlling the overall sibilance of the whole entire beat. Here, it's sound like it's taking away some of the honkiness in there. If I'm not clicking. Let's get it. You know that I'm with it. No, we acting a fool in the I stay with my bro. I call them all. Yeah, a little bit of that low back boxiness is kind of just taking out there. I'm gonna leave that alone. I like that. Uh, this is doing like a little high boost to make sure it's not super bright, which I do like. Like I said, I did add a good bit of brightness with the IM pusher. Now, the maximizer ceiling, I always set my ceilings to negative one because that's just gonna keep it from going past zero and messing with the out, you know, messing with the export and all that good stuff. Uh, let's check and see you lean and see how fast, how high is boosting it. So, we'll go ahead and bring up my you lean. We'll go ahead and detach it, you know, to keep it up in there in my face. 
and then we'll just see how it's saying. Let's get it. You know that I'm with it. No, we ain't in a fool in the issue. I stay with my bro. I call him an artist. He draw it down with a pistol. He'll draw a line with a pistol. Damn, nigga, the cross. You can bet your hands for show. We shoot with this shit. Let's a club. That deck on my phone when I'm showing no fill. I'm right on their necks. They leave me no choice. I break out the sticks like we building a board. Get out of fire. Smash the base with your force. They think you're no plan. No build like a fort. So tough. Playing chicken in life. You get plucked for your fellas. Some niggas keep fucking. They scared of the pressure. Get tell a soul what you do with whatever. They whisper like bitches. I know that they listen. Some people can't wait to go spread on your business. They got what they doing. They breaking the penny. I'm laughing at it. Why don't push through limits? I'm moving official. 20 P's in the rental. Gone. Can't look in the mirror. I'm over my. So I do like where it's at with my volume wise. I probably can keep that. If I want to, I can push it a little louder because for the Spotify loud preset that I'm using, it's at negative 11 looks and at the regular Spotify is negative 14. So I'm 1 dB over the regular Spotify, but I am 2 dB under the loud version of Spotify. So it's pretty good compromise right there. I think that's going to do good. I always try to aim 1 to 2 dBs over what the recommendeds are, which is negative 14, negative 13. So, you know, YouTube is negative 13, Spotify and iTunes is negative 14 and 16, I think, something like that. So I think this is going to be good right there. I think it's going to be loud enough and comparable. We could check my dynamic range, of course, but I'm pretty sure I got good dynamic range. Let's get it. You know that I'm with it. No, we adding a fool in the issue. I stay with my bro. I call him an artist. He draw it down with a pistol. He'll draw a line with a pistol. And I'm pretty sure that didn't manage me good. Let's say we're going to do a final pass through. I'm going to use you lean to see exactly what it is. So that's pretty much how I do it. Like I said, we can bypass everything. If I go back to here and bypass the mastering and bypass the whole bus, we'll see what it sounded like beforehand. So let's get it. You know that I'm with it. No, we ain't in a fool in the issue. I stay with my bro. I call him an artist. He draw it down with a pistol. He'll draw a line with a pistol. Damn, nigga, the cross. You can bet your hands for show. We shoot with this shit like a club. That deck on my phone when I'm showing no fill. I'm right on the next. They leave me no choice. I break out the sticks like we building a board. Get out of fire. And you can see with just two plugins, I got a pretty polished mix that's ready to go up the Apple, iTunes, Spotify, DistroKid, my artists, and all that good stuff, which I will be putting this song out, probably dropping it later this week, probably about Thursday or Friday, because I'm going to get the graphics and all that stuff done first. But very simple. The I Am Pusher is basically just a EQ and compressor plug-in all in one, which is really good because it pretty much does everything for you. You even got to think about it. Just use your ears if I like about it. And then, like I said, I, uh, Ozone 8 is a great plug-in to have because it can give you a very good starting point. And you can definitely tweak everything. And if you want to add more stuff, like you want to add some tape saturation, some you know stereo. Fit. I can add some stereo with them, which I'll probably go back and do after the video. I can add that to give a little bit more stereo feel. I can do some excitement add some little distortion in there to kind of give it a little bit more enhancement you know what I'm saying there's so much i can do with this to make it even better than it already is and say this is just a great starting point i'm happy with like i said just kind of a freestyle type thing anyway so a little bit rough and unpolished always sounds better for those type of songs so i'm gonna go with this and just let it ride so i'm gonna render this out once again we're gonna throw it in you link see overview of it and then you know wrap it up so here we go all right, so now that it is done rendering out there, we're going to drop in into Ulane to do a full analyzation real quick. If I love about buying the $40 version of it, you can see a complete analyzation of it. And mm, looks pretty good. Let's go ahead and export a PNG real quick and check and see that as well. So here is the PNG of the like the entire song. As you see, it looks pretty good. There are going to be a few discrepancies in there when it converts it over but as you can see, we didn't go over the max limit, which is really good. Like I said, that's just some encoding errors. That's you know probably gonna peak over one little bit, but hopefully the limiter will take care of that. And also Spotify now is gonna take care of that as well. It's about uh, negative 30, 13 LUTs or LUFS. So that's really good integrated. So really loud, really good. Gonna go great on Spotify. It's not gonna be turned down too much. and not gonna be boosted at all. So it's a great master right there. You see great dynamic range. Look at all that green up in there. Just looks overall good and yeah very simple like i said all i did was use two different plugins to master my tracks and y'all can see how easy it is so like i said if you enjoyed the video please leave me a comment in the description below thumb it up subscribe to the channel and like i said in the next video we'll be doing a whole thing over again mixing the whole song mastering the whole song and we're only gonna use stock plugins because that's what you guys want so with that being said y'all know who it is your boy slim aka mr different not motivated by the money but the like comments, subscribe and views and with that being said hope you guys enjoy and catch you guys in the next video
Have a good one, everybody.